Thank you very much. Madam President Rajavi, dear ladies and gentlemen, dear friends from the Iranian resistance, <clears throat> please allow me to say that I'm very honored to be here today with you at this meeting. And please allow me to say that, in my opinion, I think we are just witnessing and we are just living some historical moments, some historical days. Why I'm saying this? Because just looking at these pictures and these images from Tehran and from other cities from Iran, and while looking at pictures and images from uh, uprising in Iran in January, it's, for me it's uh, very difficult not to think what happened in Romania like almost three decades ago. When we had, we were exactly in the moment, in that moment in which we are now, uh, probably, of a regime change. Those images are just reminded me that in those days in 1989, when other countries peacefully changed the political regime, other countries in the Eastern Bloc from Europe changed their political regime to democracy in a peaceful uh, way. In Romania, it happened exactly the same thing. People were out on the street protesting against the regime. Uh, the regime and the military forces of the regime tried to uh, stop them. But they didn't succeed. They didn't succeed. And as you know, we have now, since that time, a normal country with a democracy. So uh, concluding, I'd like to say that it's very uh, good what are we doing now today, this meeting. And uh, it's very good that we are trying to open the eyes of our colleagues from different national parliaments. We are, it's very good that we are trying to open the minds and uh, um, the will of the governments, because it's, uh, it's very important to convince the governments of our country to stand uh, by a free Iran and to stand by this movement. And finally, just one thing uh, that occurred while uh, reading uh, articles about the uprising in Iran. It was the same in Romania in 1989, when the military forces from inside from, from the regime, supporting the regime, were changing uh, sides, as it happened in Tehran, when Basij militias, they burned their uh, membership cards and throwing them away, joining the protestants. This is, for me, knowing what happened in Romania, a clear sign that the regime is very, very uh, shaking. It's staying on uh, uh, not very good legs. So it's shaking. That's a clear sign that power in Iran is um, at, an, at its end. And um, democracy probably at its beginning there. Thank you very much for uh, having me here. And congratulations on your efforts once again. Thank you.